finally made it. We are here in Michigan for the weekend. A friend of mine from college is getting married on Saturday, so we're doing like a long weekend out here. And Levi is at home with my mom. He's gonna wa she's gonna watch him this weekend, and we're gonna get back on Monday. Today's what's today? Today's Friday. So we have Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then we're flying back on Monday. First of all, I just want to say it is so weird to not have Levi with us all day today. I've just really been missing him and I feel like he's just always with me these days and so it's weird to like not I guess have him with us I don't know I'm so used to or I'm getting used to having him with us all the time so I'm missing our little boy but it's nice to finally be here today it was just a long travel day we left our house this morning at mm, 6 a.m or 5 45 <laughs> I don't know I woke up at 4 30 so and I had gone to bed last night at 1.30, so I literally slept three hours, drove to the airport, and then flew all day. Right now it's like 8 o'clock Michigan time, so that's 5 o'clock our time. So basically from 6 a.m. to 5 p.m. we were traveling. So it's been a long day. I haven't eaten a full meal since breakfast, so I'm pretty pumped on going to get some food. We're going to a place called Butcher. Butcher's Union, and it has American food apparently. That's really good, and it's really close. We're staying downtown in the Grand Rapids downtown area. I don't really know what it's called other than that. We're gonna go do that, grab some food, and uh, I'll keep you posted. I'll take you with us on our weekend. I don't really know what we're doing yet other than the wedding. Look at this room. Just the two of us. It's just like the biggest table, round table I've ever seen. Okay, let's go get food. Are you ready? I'm ready. When you forget to bring a purse, I'd just like to say that it is almost 8.30 o'clock. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm really tired. <laughs> I'm running on three hours of sleep right now. So what I was trying to say is it's almost 8.30 p.m. And it is totally bright out here. It looks like it's like four o'clock. Would you guess it's like four? Yeah, no, I'm still throwing off Like right three now. or four, honestly. It's super bright out, very confusing. The lady who um, gave me my tan though before I came on this trip, I got a spray tan. She did tell me though that it stays really late, or stays lighter really late here this time of year. So she wasn't lying. That's not wrong. She was telling the darn truth. Look at us out on the town. I know. Who knew? Oh, feels weird to not have a baby on board. Look who I found in Michigan. <laughs> It is the next day. We last night we went out to dinner and some friends ended up like getting into town sooner than we thought. So my friend Alexa, who I roomed with in college, and then her boyfriend Sam. So it was really fun to get dinner with them. And it was fun to just be in Michigan with them. <laughs> uh, but today we woke up, we slept in, we had no babies, no puppies. <laughs> Although it was kind of confusing because technically it was like 7.30 or 8 our time in California, but Michigan time it was like 11, wait, three hour difference. 11, yeah, it was three, okay, it was a three hour difference. So basically it was like we slept in a lot more here than it would have been at home. But either way, it felt really nice to have like a slow morning and now we're in the car, we're heading to, <clears throat> well, we were going to go to a place called Sip get like a juice from a juice bar but it's kind of farther away and I totally forgot to bring a purse and to the wedding is tonight and so I really need to have a purse <laughs> for the wedding so we're gonna go to a little I guess shopping street area and find a purse and then find a little something to eat breakfast because even though it's already tw like 12 o'clock here it's lunchtime but for us it's like breakfast time so we're trying to stay on California time so that we don't get messed up that way, when we, um, when we go home on Monday, we're not like all screwed up on time. But anyways, that is what we're doing. We're gonna go get food, we're gonna go get a purse, and then we're gonna go meet up with some friends for lunch at this place. Um, it's like right on the lake, it looks really pretty. After we go get lunch, we're gonna get ready for the wedding, go to the wedding. So yeah, that's our day. Adam's over here driving in our nice, sweet rental car, Nissan. Nissan. I was just looking at some of the characters over here in the crosswalk. I know, there's a lot of um... What's that guy doing in the beanie shorts and the cowboy boots? <laughs> oh yeah. Huh. Those are some short shorts he's got on. Tight. 
to be honest, Grand Rapids, Michigan is different than I anticipated. Like that guy's, there's a lot of like cowboy hat wearing people. I feel like it's a lot more like Midwestern vibes than I was anticipating. It feels a lot like I went to college at TCU for my first two years of college and it's in Fort Worth, Texas. And it kind of feels like that. Like it's humid outside. I feel like the types of people that are here are very similar to the types of people that are there. And I don't know, it just wasn't really what I was expecting michigan to be like but also i had no basis for it i don't really know what i was expecting but it's definitely like a college town last night when we were walking to dinner there was a lot of college kids out you know drinking being crazy kids flip the camera around so i can show you guys it's more like suburby now that was only like a three minute from that time that i was just talking until now so i feel like grand rapids is pretty small and yeah the downtown is pretty small but it's really pretty, it's really green. Mission accomplished. Look who I found in Michigan. Also, check out this. Wow. What a view. What wow, a view. wow. Let's 80 degrees. Fishing. You wanna try to go fishing? <laughs> It is the next day. Last night we went to next day. Next day. Uh, good morning. Actually, wait. No, <laughs> it's afternoon. It's actually one o'clock. Uh, but I haven't filmed yet today. Last night we were at the wedding, and then this morning Adam and I overslept, slept in, went to pick up Jazz Jewel, and then we went over to Danielle's house. Actually, it's not Danielle's house anymore. It's Danielle and Alex's house because they're married and Alex has been living there. Danielle's moving in. We got to see their house. It is on the lake. I'm actually, I should have brought my vlog camera and like into, I should have showed you guys what it looked like because their backyard is legitimately the lake. Actually, it's a river. It was really, really pretty and um, I'm trying to come back in the summertime so I can go wakeboarding or something. But there were some paddle boarders out there, so I was kind of looking appetizing, although I heard the water's 40 degrees. So, I don't know, and it's raining outside. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, you can't see, but it started kind of raining. But it is warm, it's like 72, so it's a hot rain. We're gonna go to, I keep forgetting the name of it. We're going to Grand Haven. Check which, out Lake Michigan. Yeah, we're gonna go to Lake Michigan, which is like a 45 minute drive-ish from where we are now. So we're gonna head there. Look at the lake, hopefully find some food because I'm pretty hungry, personally. We're gonna go walk around the lake and I will bring you guys with us and actually show you because I didn't bring the camera last night to the wedding or this morning because I was too lazy to carry the camera around. But uh, I'll take you guys with us on today, today's journey. What the heck, the weather in this, do you state is ridiculous. But tell us how you really feel about the weather. It's ridiculous. 45 minute drive and it dropped 10 degrees. Is it a river or a lake? Because it does say river view. Hmm. All right, that is a 100% Lake Michigan ahead of us. <laughs> we made it. We made it. Can't hardly <laughs> see it. Because it's can't even see it. raining and foggy, but there's like a bunch of people in the water and it is cold out. It's very confusing. Oh baby, tiki time. <laughs> How does Grand Rapids look on me? Looks good. Do I fit in here? I don't know, I mean, you're in a hotel with some green floor, but you look good. I didn't mean like literally match. I meant like fit in Grand Rapids. No, you look like a California boy. Yeah, yeah I like a sore thumb. Mm -hmm. Dead giveaway on the sandals. <laughs> This is our view out of our hotel room. I actually don't know if I've shown you guys this yet. We're on the eighth floor, so we're quite high. We just got back home from dinner. It is our last night here. It's Sunday night. Pretty much a lot of things are closed around here on Sundays, which is really refreshing because, you know, Sabbath day. So they're observing the Sabbath, which I really appreciate. But Hopefully we found dinner though. Yeah, I was gonna say, <laughs> but with the whole Sabbath situation, 
we couldn't really find a restaurant that was open except for the one here at the hotel, which actually worked out great because there was hardly anyone there and the food was really good. I reserved the hotel. I mean, I reserved the restaurant for Lindsay. <laughs> she doesn't know that. We had the whole section to ourselves. It was great. Anyways, the view is really nice. We we're like looking out over the river, or the lake, or whatever body of water it is over there. We're back at our room. We're pretty tired, and we're just you know we're gonna end the vlog here because um, we're just gonna end it because <laughs> tomorrow morning we're flying out. We're going back home, and tonight we're just gonna get in our pajamas, watch a movie, go to bed. So so tired. All the fun is over. Goodbye. <laughs> just Bye, kidding. Y'all. Just kidding. <laughs> but really, the fun is over. So we're gonna end the vlog. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys got a glimpse of Grand Rapids, Michigan. We really loved it. Hope you guys <laughs> loved it too. How many times are you ending this? <laughs> I'm ending it for real. It's like the third time. Okay, bye. <laughs> bye. <Love you> <laughs>